Father John, pastor here at St. John of the Cross. I hope this video finds you doing well. One of the greatest parts of being the pastor of St. John of the Cross is to be able to lead and shepherd such generous people, people who are so willing to give of their time, their talent, and their treasures, not only to help this parish community, but to help our local community in Euclid and Richmond Heights and Willoughby Hills and the surrounding communities be willing to help our diocese through Catholic Charities, help our country and our world, especially through our partnership with Nicaragua. It's just awesome to see every day the examples of people giving great and small alike. And I'd like to kind of share with you some new endeavors here at St. John of the Cross that have to do with the way that we give of our time, our talent, and our treasure. The first is what we used to call the PIN Fund, Parishioner in Need Fund. This fund helped our parishioners who were finding themselves in need financially or for some food or for some kind of assistance. And people so generously gave of this pin to the pin fund. Well, we have been getting some requests from the local area and our, our, our requests are kind of expanding. And so we are converting the pin fund into what we will call the St. John of the Cross Outreach Fund. It will be an opportunity for us to offer outreach to those in need, especially financially. Not only helping those in need in our own parish who worship with us every week, but helping our neighbors, those who live right here in the St. John of the Cross boundaries, to help places like the Euclid Foods, Euclid Hunger Center, the Thea Bowman Center, to support some of these wonderful agencies, to partner with them, to be able to do the great work of the Lord. And so this outreach fund, the SJC Outreach Fund, replaces the PIN Fund. And there will be new opportunities and ways to give. Every other month, there will be an envelope in your envelope packet, an opportunity for you to make a little bit of a donation uh, to help support the outreach from this parish. Also, if you give on Faith Direct through online giving, there will be an opportunity for you to make your donation every other month through that. The second very exciting thing that we're starting, and I'm just so excited, is our community meal. A free meal on the third Wednesday of every month. We will prepare the meal and serve the meal. Hopefully very soon, once the pandemic ends, we'll be able to invite them in and, and sit with them and break bread together and eat with people. But this community meal is meant for those who are hungry, those who can't put food on their table, those who might be lonely. A lot of people live alone and it's hard to make a good, nutritious dinner when you live alone, or people who just like food. It's great. The meal is free and it's for anyone. An opportunity to be community. And so this community meal for now will be takeout. Uh, you call ahead, you order your meal, and we'll be happy to give it to you on the third Wednesday of the month. But we also need support to buy the food and buy the supplies to be able to do this. So again, every other month, the month that the outreach envelope is not in your packet, will be a community meal envelope. For those of you who could support the community meal with $5, $10, $20, but being able to help support feeding, again, those who are hungry, those who are lonely, those who just need community, will be an excellent opportunity. Again, if you give online, you'll have the opportunity through Faith Direct to support the community meal. And third, one of the greatest partnerships we have here at St. John of the Cross is our partnership with Nicaragua to support the people in our sister parish there, to help support their needs and the, and the needs in the diocese of this developing country, this country that does not have the same kinds of resources we do. And I think this partnership is so important that again, I'm going to put an envelope in your packet, or again, if you give online giving, you can uh, give online through Faith Direct once a month to make a Make a small donation, a big donation, whatever you might have. Give something to help our sisters and brothers in Nicaragua. We have made a commitment to partner with them. We still love special appeals and use our almsgiving and do all of the wonderful things we normally do. But I hope through this new social outreach fund, I hope through our community meal and through our continued partnership with Nicaragua, that we can continue to be great stewards of the many blessings that God has given us. And so I appreciate and am honored to serve with and for you as we are good stewards. 
And as we begin this Lenten season, it's a good opportunity to reflect on our almsgiving, our ability to share our time, our talent, and our treasure. And certainly, and hopefully, we will do it very well these next 40 days. But hopefully, we'll do it well all year long. So thank you, thank you, thank you. And I look forward to advancing our outreach through the new outreach fund, through our community meal, and through our continued partnership with Nicaragua.